He said he's gonna make a special drink. It's really special drink. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Oh. <laughs> Hey guys, in this episode, we flew from Melbourne, Australia to Boracay, Philippines to experience jet ski, parasailing, and flyboarding. Before going to the Philippines, we chose to do a long layover to Singapore, which if you haven't seen yet, you can click on the link below and see our adventure. When we arrived in Philippines, we stayed in Manila for one day. We're just in a taxi with... Roger! We are Roger. Hello! Hello. <laughs> we first left our luggage in Manila just to make the transport easier since we have to ride a small boat going to the island itself. At one point, we thought we are going to miss our flight due to the long queue in the airport. Just arrived in uh, Terminal 4 going to Barangay. Um, unfortunately, there's like a very, very long line. Um, so, I don't know. Hopefully, we'll make it. We still have like one hour. But there's been delays, so it sort of worked out for us, I guess. We were very excited upon departure, not to mention weather was very nice when we left. The flight only took roughly 45 minutes. Upon arrival, we were a bit surprised because it was drizzling a bit and few locals said there will be a typhoon coming the next day. At this point, we were still very optimistic and just kept going. From sunny day to a rainy day, but oh, I am hoping for a better day tomorrow, yeah. Four days we'll after. Fingers crossed, but yeah. Upon arrival to the airport in Katiklan, we organized our transport to Boracay Island. We had to ride a van for 10 to 15 minutes to the port and from there, you have to get yourself ready for a bit more queue and registrations. Trying to do the uh, QR code before entering Barakay. Medyo hassle po talaga siya. So you actually need the transport fee, the terminal fee, and environmental fee. Something's worth noting is that pricing for tourists and locals is different. From here on, before boarding the boat, the wind and rain suddenly picked up. Picture perfect. The perfect weather for the beach. Lucky us, but show must go on. Our boat rides, um, it wasn't too bad. It was just a bit rough to see. Um, it was actually yeah. about 10 minutes. Yeah, just a 10 minutes boat ride. And from arrival, we needed to take our third and final transportation of the day going to our hotel in the form of e-trike which is similar to Tuk Tuk from Thailand. After the e-trike yeah, dropped so us off, bad. we had to walk a couple of hundred meters to our hotel called the Ocean hotel. Club Beach Resort. It's snowing in the Philippines! <laughs> we were greeted with a warm welcome with the lovely staff, especially Christine, their manager, who kind of gave us a free room upgrade. She even oh, let us choose between two room. of the rooms available. Oh, sorry. Sorry. And this is room 504 and Swiss things still around. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I think this is nice. At least we can have a look at the um, ocean view. You like it? Yeah. Welcome to our humble home. This is my favorite area. We're gonna test it out. Oh. Very comfortable, 10 out of 10. And our office. Settled, we immediately went out for a walk. Luckily, the rain has stopped for a bit, which gave us some time to explore the beautiful island of Boracay late in the evening. We tried different street Thank foods you. while watching other people having a good day by the beach. At this point, we have been keeping an eye on the weather update, but sadly, there's no stopping the typhoon from coming. All water sports activities were cancelled, for the next three to four days, which didn't leave us much choice. 
but to stick with land tours such as riding ATV and sightseeing. It's not what Mud we've expected, but we have to sort of make the best out of the situation. <laughs> In all honesty, we still had fun. Met familiar faces who we spent few days drinking and partying with. The best bartender here in um, Ocean Club. <laughs> I don't know how many free drinks he gave us. Yeah. He said he's gonna make a special drink. Do a special drink. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Oh, 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 special drink. <laughs> Say hi, John. John. John, hello, John. <laughs> Hello, welcome to my channel, guys. <laughs> so, this is what we with the fire dancers and together with our guest DJ Pata Boss. It's a personal fire team, basically. <laughs> So last day in Boracay, um, it's quite early in the morning, we're just having our breakfast, pack up our bags and then go to the airport later. Hopefully there's no more additional delays because um, from yesterday uh, the typhoon has landed it's just crazy. We weren't able to do any water activities. In our way back to the airport. Hopefully, next time we visit Boracay, we can finally do water activities that we wanted. So, stay tuned for more adventures. Or if you guys have any suggestions on where to go next, feel free to leave us a comment down below and we'll catch you later.